What's happening? What's happening, everybody? Yeah, check it out. This is the Honorable King Calvin Jones Jr. You know, King Calvin Jones Jr. Show live, man. You know, I've been going at it full force all day to day on the Sabbath day of the Lord. The real day that you worship, the day this is the day that you set everything aside and you really seek God in this hour. You know, in a time of tribulation, man, it's a time of tribulation. You got a lot of people who know God, but not worshiping him as God. Come on out of here. This is day of the rest of the Lord. You know what I'm saying? And even God say, fine. I mean, you can do what's good. And so I'm doing what's good. I ain't connected to, I ain't connected to what folk can think I'm connected to. Come on out of here. I'm connected to God, the kingdom of God. That's the only work. Come on out of here that I'm doing the kingdom of God work. You know what I'm saying? Even if I'm doing some other stuff, you know what I'm saying? But that's the first priority. First, everything else follows after that. You understand? Because of the power of God on me. I see I cast out devils. You know, that's my occupation. I say, what is your occupation? Who are your boss? You, you find out that God is boss. Oh, hello, somebody. God become, he, he, my, he who I follow. I don't know what the devils think. Come on out of here. Devils, he, ha, he, ha, 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 and all this stuff in this day and time. But we, as the people of God, we the ones get the last laugh. You understand? Because they the creepy thing. You understand? They the creepy thing that crawl up on the earth. If you ain't serving the kingdom of God, then you are an opposer of the kingdom of God. So you know what your end is going to be. You know what the, a person know what the end going to be. Because they what? Ain't serving the kingdom of God. It ain't, there, there is no other thing that exists. There really ain't nothing else. You understand? Everything else has to submit over to the way the kingdom sakes submit over. It's not going the other way around no more. That doesn't happen. This is a this the this is the end of the age is for a lot of stuff to happen. See, this is a new day. It's been said for the longest. People still don't get it. They thinking like some people think I'm here to square dance with them. I'm not here to square dance with folks. You done got prophecy after prophecy after prophecy. I, I, people that came in and out of the city prophesying from church to church, radio, rap, music, all kind of stuff. And people still ain't getting it. They still kind of like don't get it. What God is saying all around them is just happening. Like, what do you think that happened? That was a God that by the last couple of people did stuff. I started seeing stuff, but like, see, look, I was, you're trying to get away from what is true for the fact that the matter was of uh, that you coming against me. Come on out of here. A person don't want to come against me in a natural sense. You know what I'm saying? In a natural sense, like, come on, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm a whole different person in the natural. Most people do stuff from a distance. Come on out of here. You ain't going to do nothing up close. I cast that devil out. Hello, somebody. And and fit at the same time. And away. Far and near. I still cast the devil out. Hello, somebody. I still will cast the devil out. See, my occupation, where I come from, let me introduce you to the way that I do things. See, I resurrect the dead. You understand? I speak to the dry bones and they live again. See, people got to get familiar. They don't understand what King Calvin Jones, the king and the priest unto the Lord really mean. 
They've been taught wrong. They've been indoctrinated wrong. I've been going around for the last couple of years prophesying what the Lord was going to say. And I was found faithful in the prophecy. I prophesied to the whole state of Michigan. You understand? I don't prophesy to the leaders of Michigan, the ones that were supposed to be the leader of it. I done came here and if I don't do nothing else, I've done the work of the Lord. People who want to have position here, I've told them what God wanted me to tell them. I don't have to, I'm not here like that. If it hadn't have been that God blessed me with two kids and he blessed me with stuff here, I wouldn't have stayed. Come on out of here. But God has given me a harvest. So why, you know, then I got to save the people of God. They want to be saved while I'm here. I'm not here to lollygag, lollygag and square dance for nobody. I'm not here to square dance. I'm not here to be on none of their stuff. I don't want to do none of their stuff. They don't get it. Folks don't get it sometimes. They don't get that I'm not who you think you thought I was. I'm only what I told you I am. You understand? I'm a prophet of the kingdom of God. You understand? I'm a king and a priest unto the Lord. I'm a G-O-D. You see, my duty is to judge the earth. That's what I'm called to do. See, we become omnipotent like God. We have multitudes of attributes. See, you got a multitude of attributes that God has blessed you with. See, folks want to get their way, but they were playing. But they really wasn't real to what it was they say was doing. Now, granted that everybody had a little seasons, but you don't stay in that season that you've been in. You got the press to the high calling of the Lord. You have to press every day. You got to press through the haters, the outside influence. The outside influence can be anything. It be on them televisions. Come on out of here. And then you have to say, wait a minute. What that devil just say through that? Yeah, I'm going to turn you off now. Bleep. In the name of Jesus. Devil, come on out of here. Hello, somebody. You, you're like, what? You what, what? Come on out of here. You got to set aside what God said do. You understand? No man can serve two masters for you either love one and hate the other. And guess what? I roll with God. And they ain't got that yet. You understand? I roll with the creator of the universe. I roll with none of these false things or whoever folk think I roll with. You understand? It's only God and God only, partner. That's all that I really roll it. All the rest of this stuff is a bunch of hoopla. Seriously. It's a bunch of hoopla. It ain't realistic. Folk ain't realistic. The only thing gonna matter is the kingdom of God. That's the kingdom that's about to that's what's about to reign and rule. And they don't want that. Satan don't want that to happen. And he got to enforce us to think, oh, yeah, I'm going to do this and do that. These devils ain't going to do nothing. Come on out of here. They ain't going to do nothing. That's why God been shaking them loose. I remember some time back. Same thing happened to these other people. Every time it happened, they shake them loose right up out of there. Like, come on out of here. The next thing you know, they got somebody else. I, I got them testimonies. Folks don't know nothing about me. They think that I'm like everybody else. I'm not like everybody else. So don't get focused. Folks start getting focused. On me, I'm not everybody else. Don't think that I'm trying to be cool with people. 
I'm not trying to be cool with people. I'm just trying to do the work of the Lord and get on out of body this thing. You understand? So that I can rush from it all. I ain't talking about no other type. I'm talking about rest from doing the work of the Lord. You want to rest? Come on out of here. You're like, man, I got to cast out these devils. These some strong little demons. So I got to cast them out and shut them off. Come on out of here. You got to put them on. You got to put them on mute. Like, hey, I'm putting it on mute. Because the simple fact of the matter, it ain't profiting me nothing. See, you got to be able to cast them devils out and bring sight to the blind. These are the assignments of the Lord. It ain't what other folk been thinking. They think everything the other way. See, we seek in first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, and all these things shall be added. Forget what they think. I don't care what folks think. They be like, are you going to do this? Oh, you want to bet? You don't know me. Come on out of here. And I never knew you. So depart from me, like Jesus would say, depart from me. I don't know you. Come on out of here. People don't know. They start thinking, oh, we know who you is, is what they say on this, that, and the other. You don't necessarily know me. Come on out of here. God then hid me. And even when he hid me, the enemy think that he can find me. Okay. Oh, let's zoom in on this one. Oh, uh, devil, don't think about this one. Come on out of here. Don't even think about my thoughts. Don't think about my mind. Don't think about my words. Come on out of here. Folks want to cleave on to everything that you say. <laughs> like, nope, you ain't a part of this heritage. Come on out of here. You in the house of Pharaoh. You ain't in the house of my God. Come on out of here. You in the house of Pharaoh. So Pharaoh folks, soldiers want to keep on playing. Simple fact of the matter, you know, I, ain't this, I ain't the person that they think I am. See, some people think they know me. You don't even know me. Even if I say you don't. So the truth of the fact of the matter, I'll be the same one. Come on out of here. <laughs> that will do some stuff. Come on out of here. Kingdom bound to you. You understand? Kingdom bound. I won't just say you repent. You know. <laughs> you know. So I'd be like, y'all gotta stay far away from the presence of God. That's that, that that's a serious thing. I don't play with no devils. I don't play with no devils. I don't hee haw.